Okay, before this video starts, I just want to let you guys know that I appreciate each and every one of you that really support me and my channel, and there is one supporter of mine that I have to say, yes, I have noticed you there in the comments, Nace and V, and since you said it was your birthday today, I would just like to wish you a very happy birthday and hope you enjoy life as a 14 year old. Hope you have a great day, glad to hear I'm your favorite YouTuber, it actually blows my mind that I even am one, but thanks for supporting me and I hope you have a good birthday. Alright guys, now let's get to the video. Yesterday, Funimation released the final two episodes of My Hero Academia Season 4, which means the season is now officially over for everybody, both Japanese and English watchers. And like a lot of you, I did rewatch the last two episodes in dub because I'm that freaking obsessed with this anime that I will literally watch it in both dub and sub, but that basically reignited my need for new My Hero Academia episodes. And I'm sure that also happened for a lot of other people. We want My Hero Academia episodes and we want it now, but of of course that can't really happen. Like I've said before, My Hero Academia seasons are never back to back and they're always at least a few months apart from each other, usually starting in the spring and ending in the fall, but this time we got the other way around with season 4. But there has also been a lot of progress and a lot of hiccups for the road to season 5 and you could of course hear about it all on the channel, there are videos on everything going on. The latest was about an issue going on with the Japanese voice actor for Bakugo which will probably scare a lot of people once you hear about it. But but again, that's right on the channel for you to check out. But as we wait for Season 5, they actually did announce some new content between Season 4 and Season 5 recently, but in order to actually view this content, you'll have to get the My Hero Academia Season 4 Volume 6 DVD or Blu-ray set because it's releasing as an extra piece of story for that. Basically, this is a short story special that I'm not even sure if we can call it canon. It's not an OVA, it's actually being described as a drama CD, which is interesting and both scary because that labeling makes me think that it might not even have visuals which would be kind of whack if you ask me. But the story is going to be really big for those people in the My Hero Academia community who desperately want to see Kaminari and Jiro be together. I'm not really one of those people who care about that actually becoming a thing but I am someone who cares about new story content so here I am. So the new story is going to be focused on these two characters specifically and it looks like it could have some horror elements as well the way the story is the described in the synopsis, and the synopsis goes as follows. As the day of the cultural festival draws nearer, Jiro realizes that she forgot her notebook in the music room and asks Kaminari to accompany her to get it back in the middle of the night. As they enter the pitch black school building, they grow more and more fearful and come across a disturbing shadow. What's worse is that even though there shouldn't be anyone there, music is playing from the music room. Will the two of them come out unharmed? So obviously they're not gonna come out harmed, they're not gonna die or anything. The sixth place during the school festival arc and we actually have some audio from the special short story as well, so here's some of that. <laughs> はYep, we don't have subtitles, so most of us don't really know exactly what they were saying, but it all did sound interesting. The release date for this is August 19th, 2020, so about two months from now. I want to thank you guys for watching today's video, and I would appreciate it if you left a like before you go. My name's Kajik, and I'll talk to you in the next video.